right, guys, you might not be prepared for it, but I'm going to show you the best loadouts in Fortnite Battle Royale build mode, all right? It's simple. All right, so to get the best loadout ever in this season, in this battle royale of build mode you're gonna need to land at fencing fields i know i know it might be contrary to what you believe but this is perfection and i'll show you why let me just get a shotgun real quick or i guess this is an smg actually I need to get some more loot sniper come on give me something good something i like something i desire what is this, this is the most crammed loot box i've ever seen two smgs take out this guard wow that does a lot of damage close range Camera's out. Need like heels? No? Okay. Jump through the window. He's right here. He doesn't hear me because it sounds like a robot. There you go. Just gotta be aware of your circumstances, your environment, you know? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take one of these. We're gonna get after it. Never mind, she's gonna get after it. She's hit me for everything. Oh no. He's gonna play angles on her. No. She's shooting me through the carpet. I don't know how she's doing it, but she's shooting me through the freaking carpet. There we go. Somebody else is taking her out. This is actually what I want. I'm going into the crawl space. Ah! Ah! Oh, there's no chance I live. Oh, there's no chance I live. Grab everything, grab everything. You can't build up here. Holy smoke. Okay, we got what we needed. We need to just get out. Go away, Peter. Leave this wretched land. We're just gonna just head for a better, better place. We got the medallion. We got Nisha's striker AR, the best AR in the game. That's honestly a really good start, but there's a lot more stuff we need to get if we want the best loadout, all right? The best loadout, I, I can't get. I, I was having so much trouble getting through that windmill. What? I think I broke it. Oh, they already broke it. So this is the best they are. I think that definitely deserves a slot. And then the shockwaves deserve a slot. But the other slots can be filled more appropriately. Now I'm running all the way to Snooty because in Snooty we have Peter Griffin. And his shotgun is what we need. That's the shotgun we need for uh, part of the best loadout. I think you can get five more HP if I pop this. Taking the sports car. And we got to find the person who got Peter Griffin's shotgun. They're probably in the vault still, maybe. Let me line this up. They're fighting over here somewhere. That's a robot that was shooting me. There's a guy right down there. Okay, that guy has Peter Griffin's uh, shotgun. I can tell. Just trust me on this one. Woo! Full shredded just with the AR. Think about that. The mythic AR just beat the mythic shotgun. Give me that medallion. Oh, shoot. It's so accurate, even just hip fire. That's why Nisha's striker AR, this one right here, is so good. But you also do need a shotgun for certain situations. Peter Griffin's hammer pump shotgun is fantastic. I'm gonna go ahead and get these medkits. And now we're, honestly, we're almost complete the best loadout ever. We're missing one more crucial thing though. Peter Griffin's hammer pump shotgun is really good. The auto shotgun's actually pretty good too. And the one from uh, Tony the Tiger right over here in Lavish Lair. It could be good depending on your play style, and it's even better if you're playing zero build. But in build mode, I think that Peter Griffin shotgun's better, because look, if you're in a build fight and you need to take a peek and you need to shoot, it's just better to have this shotgun as opposed to have the auto shotgun, because you're gonna do less damage in a fight like this, you know? So if you're playing build mode, if you're playing smart, these are the best weapons you could have. The shockwave is just incredible because if you're stuck in builds or if you really need to fly somewhere fast, you can just use it to get out of a sticky situation and it's really fantastic. In terms of heals, normally you're gonna carry shields, right? But with the medallions, I got two of them. The more you have, the faster you heal shield and you heal it automatically. So if you get hit, you start regenerate shield after a little bit of time. That means if you just avoid people a little bit once you get hit, you get all your shield back. Now this kind of completes it here, the grapple blade. The grapple blade is one of the best mobility items we have ever had in Fortnite and I absolutely love it. You can use it just infinitely basically uh, if you give it some time to charge back up. And it's great just for getting ahead with the zones moving so fast. Just don't use the spinny attack thing. If you use that, um, it's pretty journey. So this is perfection right here, this loadout. 
plus the medallions. Literally the best loadout you're going to find in the game. I'm going to show you how good it is by winning this game, absolutely destroying everyone with the best loadout ever. See the guys up there? You can do this. Get some height on them. Woo! Give me that crown. Full piece. That's my wall. Where are you looking? Somebody was trying to shoot me in the back. You see, in the situation like this, I could just try to run away like that. Use my movement to just really get away from any snipers and just continue hunting players down. To do good in Fortnite Chapter 5, you have to be good at the movement. You have to be good at just recognizing situations and you have to have the best loadout. I mean, this right here is literal perfection. You're looking at literal perfection in terms of a loadout. Will things change as they update and nerf things or buff things? Probably. But right now, this is the best loadout. Okay, I'm moving. I'm gonna try to see if I can, actually, I'm gonna go back and get a bounty. You see, I've been using this grapple blade a lot and I still haven't really run out of charges. I'm gonna get a bounty. To really use the grapple blade properly, you have to understand the physics of it. Like if you bounce off this, you're gonna bounce off that tree. So understand that when you're hooking onto things to be the most effective that you could be. Also recognize when you have medallions, people will see a yellow circle around you. If I see one of the, like this, this is a medallion circle. This is a bounty circle. This is a medallion circle. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh. Oh, smoke. So I know somebody with a medallion is over here. I'm going to assume it's somebody in this fight. Oh, it's a guy over here. So I'm going to go ahead and just use this shockwave up. Try to get into his box. So they actually both have medallions looking at it now. Hit him a lot harder than he hit me. I have the best weapons, but this is getting to be a tricky situation. It's got on height. I might just try to fight this. Ooh, that hurts. See, and sometimes, no matter what, you're gonna get into situations you don't like. Look how fast my shield is regenerated. Just chill for a little bit. You'll be all right. A lot of people are trying to fight me at once. So I just need to chill, relax. I can even pop a med kit. I'll probably find more. I'm gonna hop in my cone. Sounds like this guy's getting absolutely lasered. Got him. Patience. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this uh, medallion here. Both these medallions. Now I'm gonna recover my shield even faster. Now, this Hyper SMG is cool, but let me tell you, this is the best stuff. You already have the best stuff, I promise you. So, I know this guy's in here. I just full piece them. Took advantage of the angles and absolutely crushed them. Now, there's one more dude. He's got a snipe, but that's okay. Look, look how fast I'm recovering my shield. I'm already at 30 shield and I just got hit. This is a really fun season for sweats, I gotta say. Because that can happen. You can just chill for, what, 20 seconds and I'll be okay. You just don't want to get hit by a headshot snipe, honestly. That's just an easy limb. I'm going to go for it. Well, okay. Oh, that guy just got sniped. Hello? I was going to hit him with the grapple thing. You do got to be smart whenever you use your uh, shockwaves. 28 white. Now, just know that whenever you hit somebody for white, if they have a medallion, that's actually going to be pretty critical damage. Oh, shoot. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! All right, I took 50 damage. I'm chilling. He's gonna try to take this wall, probably. Oh. Under and ten. Got his toe. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts. That hurts. That hurts. I gotta recover shield for sure. And I also gotta go ahead and pop this med kit. I'm at one HP. Oh my gosh, I'm using angles here. I don't know why he's not pushing me. 
It's actually really dumb of him. I'm now at 200 HP from one HP. How long did I take? I'm gonna use this to my advantage and just shock up. Done. G G. The best weapons will do that for you. The medallions will do that for you. Happy hunting.